Hello, my name is Cassidy Abbott, and this is the final exam for my Intro to Anthropology class that took place in the fall of 2022. What were at least two main concepts that I learned in this course this semester? This semester, I learned that our bodies are used to communicate our differences. When it comes to the relationship between one's body and society, the mod the body can communicate statuses, ranks, and relationships. Bodies can also communicate positive things such as national pride, but also communicate negative things such as abuse. Another thing that I had learned was that there are differences in the rituals of men and women. Women are associated with family, whereas men are associated with knowledge and hunting. By saying this, one difference that stood out to me was that women are usually clothed and initiated by themselves, whereas men are nude and initiated in groups for bonding purposes. The last thing I learned was that there are two components that make up one's identity, those that are achieved and those that are ascribed. Language, family, and nationality are all examples of the components that are ascribed, whereas religion and political views are examples of those that are achieved. What was the most difficult aspect of this course? Well, I thought that preparing for the reading assignments was the most difficult part of this course. When it came to the first question, I often struggled to find the answers and had to reread the material a few times before I figured out what the answer was. How much time did I spend studying for this course per week? I spent approximately six hours a week studying for this course. I set two hours aside for the reading, two hours aside for highlighting and taking notes about the main points in the reading, and two hours to complete the reading assignment. What was one thing that I learned that surprised me? Well, I learned that in many cultures, gender is not determined by biology. For example, in indigenous American culture, a two-spirit is a person that identifies with both male and female roles. It also surprised me that they looked at them as a third gender and that they were very valuable and important. Do I have any comments about this course? Overall, I enjoyed this course and liked the aspect that there were no tests. This allowed people who get anxiety and are bad test takers, such as myself, a way to prove that they understood the material effectively without the stress of preparing and taking a test. I still studied the material the same I would for a quiz or a test to properly prepare me to be able to answer the reading questions.